Dear viewers of Fiji Sun TV USA, we are here in Mehran restaurant in Fremont with Mr. Jiwan Jutshi, <laughs> the founder and CEO of Indo-American Community Indo Federation. Indo-American. And how long have you, has it been in operation? Uh, 29 years. 29 Next years. Next year we'll celebrate wow. 30th year. Is that Hopefully, right? Hopefully, God willing. Oh my God. I, the time passed so we didn't even yeah. realize. I can't, cannot really believe it. Yeah. Well, you know, what, what motivated me to call you and get this going? I wanted one uh, pre-event. Okay, okay. And the one, of course, after the event. That is very nice of yeah, you. It always helps. Yeah. It always helps. Uh, and the fact that, you know, not much is going on. Right. And I noticed that you taken the lead after the pandemic. So I thought of teaching base with you. Thank and, you. And uh, give you this hands up. Thank you, Hanif, sir. And you're most welcome. So give, uh, give us a little, uh, you know, for the viewers, a little bit sure. about... Sure. Uh, I'll give you some background uh -huh. about the organization. Sure. Uh, we started this organization back in 1993. Okay. But incorporated it and it became a non-profit few years later. So, uh, as I said earlier, we'll be completing 30 years next year. Uh, after 9-11, we started this uh, unity dinner, and um, it was basically a celebration. Uh -huh. That's how it started, a celebration of our diversity, a celebration of our unity, and, uh, and also trying to address the issues which are contentious. Mm -hmm. And there are so many issues which we all know every day. We face issues, whether it is hate crime or it is gun violence or, right. or even issues like, um, you know, unemployment and immigration. And there are many, many issues. So what we have been doing is uh, uh, since year 2002, when we first celebrated the Unity Dinner in uh, conjunction with Martin Luther King's birthday, uh, and it was it was in uh, January when we first started the Unity Dinner. Later on, we moved to March because there was a conflict uh, with Republic Day celebration and other celebrations. <clears throat> uh, so we moved our celebration to March. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you another question. Thanks for that intro. How? Is your organization different from other Indian community-based uh, organizations? Such it's as a very good question you asked. It's exactly like one of my friends, uh, who is was was that time the the president of uh, APIO, the Association of Physicians of Indo Americans. Yeah, the doctor. Yeah. Uh, he exactly explained it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he didn't ask me a question. He explained it. He said, "Jeevan." This is the only organization which celebrates diversity and uh, we all believe in it, but we don't have an event. We do not celebrate uh, unity in diversity. Mm -hmm. We celebrate, you know, different other, uh, you know, things, but, but not unity in diversity. So what he basically said, which is very true, that ours is the only organization which focuses on promoting unity uh, in diversity. Okay. So that's how, the, that's how we it, are different. Yeah, that's, different. That's what makes us very different. Yeah. So what has happened to other organizations? I don't hear much about them over the years. Uh, well, there are organizations, uh, some of them, uh, Hanif Sab, uh, you know, which you are familiar with, I'm very sure, uh, over the years, they are still uh, Operating. They're still offering, you know, certain things to the uh, community, like you have celebration of, uh, you know, all the festivals and uh, mm -hmm. Holi and Diwali right. and, uh, and, and other, um, you know, other uh, uh, functions. So, okay, this particular year you're hosting it at the we Indian are, Cultural Center. We, what, we are, what we do is, this is our signature event, this is our uh, annual event. Right. We do other things also during the year, but this is our annual event when we have uh, 
you know, three to four hundred people who come together, and they are all from diverse backgrounds. I mean, they are Hispanics, they are Chinese, they are uh, Afghanis, and they are, of course, mm. you know, mainstream Indians and all other people. Right. So this is, again, a unique event because people who come to our event uh, obviously do not go to other events okay. because they are not yeah, either invited or there is no occasion for them to go and celebrate those so, kind of events. So this year, uh, what are your highlights uh, on on This Sir? year, uh, uh, Hanif Sahib... Well, uh, give us the date. Give us the date. First of all, the date is April 21st. Okay. It's a Friday. Okay. Uh, April 21st and uh, almost a month from now. So we are going to be holding this in uh, India Community Center, which is in Milpitas. Right. Last year we had our event in Fremont, mm -hmm. which is the Fremont downtown center. Okay. Unfortunately, they haven't done a good job in designing that, building that. It has very small capacity. Okay. Only 168 uh, is the official capacity, but we had about 200 with some chairs and stuff we kept in the back. And it doesn't have a very good stage and, uh, and sound system. So we had to move back to uh, Milpitas. Community and, center. Uh, and it's a very nice center there. It has so a you'll nice have, stage you'll have and the dinner. You're gonna, you're gonna have the dinner and then the rest of the program. So what we'll have is from five to six, we'll have a conference. Okay. And conference will be on gun violence, and uh, the issues which are being faced by teenagers and uh, some of that community after the pandemic, okay. depressions and, you know, so many other things. So we have panelists who are, uh, you know, like um, Senator, uh, newly elected Senator Ayesha Wahab, mm. she's on that panel. Uh, we have a city council member. Uh, she's she's uh, also on the panel <coughs> from Fremont City, and uh, then of course uh, it's being uh, moderated by Anjali uh, Zutshi. Uh, she's my daughter-in-law. She's an attorney in Washington D.C., mm -hmm. so she's coming here only for this purpose. So then we have uh, you know a, another guy. His name is Fish Stark. So you know he's son of former so congressman uh, Pete Stark. So there is it's a very powerful panel. You know, you have police chief of Fremont and some other people. So we'll have this panel discussion. And uh, after that, we'll have social hour from, from 6 to 7.30. Okay. And during that social hour, we'll also finish with the dinner. Okay. And uh, then we enter the... You know, we have the national anthem and, uh, you know, few speeches. Mm -hmm. uh, we have Congressman uh, uh, Rokhana, who is our congressman of this district. So he'll be speaking. Then we have some senators. We have three senators uh, who are going to be present. And one senator will speak. And then we have a host, a host of uh, assembly members, mayors, mm -hmm council members, uh, school board members, and and just name it. There's a lot of elected officials. I think by now we have probably about 27 elected officials, right. including the county supervisors from Alameda County, from Santa Clara County. Right. Uh, we have the city uh, manager, uh, not manager, the, the mayor of San Jose also who is coming. He just became the mayor. The previous mayor also used to always come, but now this new mayor, Mayor Mahan, is also Is there going to us. be any uh, other programs or entertainment programs? There's going to be a wonderful cultural program, uh -huh. and we are also going to be celebrating the RRR, that song. Oh, okay. So we'll have that song also. We'll do that. And then we'll also have some cultural program. We have a Chinese uh, beautiful... Uh, beautiful, uh, you know, dance and uh, you presentation. Know, some presentation. Yeah. And uh, I'm looking for a Hispanic one also. So we always have diverse, you know, cultural programs, you know, where we have. I'm also trying to get some Afghani groups. Uh, uh, so we try to have uh, a multicultural type of an event. And um, 
after that, you know, after the program is over, which we are expecting at uh, uh, 9.45, uh, then after that we'll uh, have a beautiful music program where we have some beautiful Bay Area singers uh, who are going to be sung singing, uh, mm -hmm. you know, some Bollywood songs and, uh, uh, you know, Tollywood songs and, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, Hollywood songs, whatever, uh, you know, they want to sing and it'll be a beautiful mm -hmm. program. Is there a particular band there? Uh, this, it's a... It's a uh, we have picked up some excellent uh, artists, artists. Uh, singers okay. in the Bay Area, and they're young, wonderful people. Okay. And they're just phenomenal. So they'll be singing, and uh, and they were asking me, if it goes till one o'clock in the night, I said, you stay there for the whole night. Uh, <laughs> ICC is not going to kick you out. <laughs> so we'll have a wonderful celebration, wonderful program, okay. bringing the, you know, the spirit of unity, uh, you know, camaraderie and uh, togetherness, uh, you know, and, 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 you know, unite our uh, diverse groups, diverse community. Great. Thank you very much for that uh, overview there. And uh, we we'll plan to join you in there. Absolutely. Yeah. You will be there. Uh, you know, uh, it's so good to see you after a long time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay. Give me one second. Yeah.